Welcome. Another interesting topic that this second canto brings about is the idea of avatar, avatar tattva. This is one of the ten main topics of the Bhagavad. Every Purana has main topics and one of them generally is avatar, which means the principle of divine descent. Avatara means crossing from up to down, one of the many instances where the absolute, the infinite, manifests itself to the finite. For example, Shastra is one of those instances, Parampara, of course. So Avatar, the Lord himself appears in different, what sometimes called incarnations, but actually that's not the ideal word, since the Lord remains transcendental to any type of flesh influence, if you will. So in one section of this second canto, different, a list of different avatars is mentioned, and that will be developed along the different uh, volumes of the book. An important point in this regard that the Bhagavad wants to make, uh, and it made before in the first canto actually, but now we are presenting it, is that between all these avatars or divine descents of God, there is also the principle of avatari, mm, or the source of all avatar. Mm. So because of this, Bhagavad says in the first canto, mm, Krishna to Bhagavan Swayam, this famous quote that Prabhupada translated as the Supreme Personality of Godhead, or as Guru Maharaj says, his God, Krishna, is God when he wants to be himself, God beyond God. Hmm? Krishna is not God, but is more than God. Hmm? When God is taking a rest for all this a load of being the Supreme Cosmic Administrator and really expresses himself in the fullest, fullest intimacy of being at home, so this is a very important principle that the Bhagavad was to give from the very beginning. Janma Dhyasya Yattaha. Bhagavad says, today we will speak about the source of all. So generally the, the Veda says the source of all is Brahman. We'll find it in the, in, in the Purana says the, so, the a particular aspect of Brahman is Parabrahman, Vishnu. But the Bhagavad will speak about the source of Vishnu, Parabrahman Vishnu, who is Krishna. And of course the Bhagavad will go even further no? In, in, in its final section, speaking about Mahaprabhu, even in a very hidden way, as the most esoteric and intimate aspect of the divine. So, Bhagavad from the very beginning, Jamma Dhyasayata, speaks about the source of the source of the source of all divine descents and manifestation, Bhagavan Sri Krishna Brajendananda, Sri Krishna, Sri Krishna in Vrindavan. So, see you in the next session, and we will continue with some of these interesting topics from the Bhagavad. Thank you.